right, so I'm just cutting my Hawaiian sweet rolls just cutting a little square on top of each one just like this. If they're all cut, now I'm gonna go ahead and just press down that middle just like this. Look how easy it goes down because we cut it so nicely. We don't wanna waste any of this bread, so instead of ripping it out, we just press it down because that bread is so yummy. I don't wanna miss any of it. No crumbs left behind. Okay. So you're making little holes. Yeah, we're making little holes. Like little boats. Yep, and this is gonna be a super yummy and easy dessert. Okay, once you have your little holes, I'm gonna go ahead and grab some cream cheese. Let's put this to the side. And I have a little butter cutter right here. Right. And you're gonna we... do that with cream cheese? Yes. It just makes my life a little bit easier. Grab your cream cheese and just Press down, just like this. Oh, they're perfect slices. Yeah, perfect slices to go in our oh, sweet Hawaiian yeah. rolls. Yeah. yeah, so just grab a little square and just tuck it right in there, just like oh, this. It's, it's perfect. Exactly, I knew this butter cutter would be my friend with this recipe. So just quickly get a little square into each one. And then we're gonna add some more sweetness next. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, so just go ahead and put one slice of cream cheese in each of our little holes like this. Beautiful. Okay, now that we have our cream cheese, look, we have a lot left over for bagels tomorrow. Now for the goodies. I'm gonna start off with some blueberry pie filling. And I have my little mini scooper. And we're just gonna put a little bit in our scooper just like this, and then right on top of that cream cheese goodness. Mm -mm -mm. Doesn't that just oh, look delicious? That looks really good. Blue or blueberries and cream cheese are my favorite combo. It's gonna be almost like a cream cheesecake bite. All right, and I'm gonna skip the middle row and go straight to the Third row. Do you know what my favorite pie filling is? Uh, I think I could guess. Cherry. <laughs> All right, well, I'm gonna make your dreams come true. So, yep, we're gonna get some cherry pie filling for that middle row, just like this. Mm -mm -mm. And you could use strawberry pie filling, you could use peach pie filling, you could use apple, whatever makes your heart happy, go for it. Now we are talking. Look at this. Yeah. Looks amazing. Doesn't it look incredible? Yeah, wow. Okay, beautiful. Now these are just gonna go in the oven, just like this. They just need to heat up and melt that cream cheese. The oven sets at 350 and it's gonna be in there for just 15 minutes. Isn't that quick? That's so quick. Yum, 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 in my tum. While that's in the oven, I'm gonna go ahead and grab a bowl and a whisk, get some powdered sugar and be Generous with your powdered sugar. That looks good. That's about half a cup of powdered sugar. Then we're gonna add about a tablespoon of milk. Plenty, okay? And then we're gonna whisk this together. And this is gonna create a yummy icing for our delicious dessert that's cooking in the oven. Mm -mm -mm. See how that comes together so easy? This is something you could do for like cinnamon rolls or French toast. It's so easy, just two ingredients. You probably already have these in your house and you get the most delicious icing. Ooh, look, that was literally 30 seconds of whisking and now it's ready for our dessert. You made, the, you made that look so much easier than, than when I did it. Oh yeah, I know what I'm doing. All right, these were ready super quick, you guys. Okay. Now, before we cut one out, we gotta get that icing that we literally just made seconds ago. And we're just gonna drizzle it right on top to make it extra sweet and extra delicious. Mm -mm -mm. And you can go crazy with this icing, just make it yummy and sweet. And you could even skip this icing if you don't want all the sugar. But you guys know me, I love sugar, so I'm always gonna do extra icing. It looks like sweetened condensed milk. Yeah, you could even throw some sweetened condensed milk on there. That's a great idea. All right, time to 
get these out. Okay, got one. Oh, still good. All right, and let's get a cherry one. My favorite. Ooh. Be a little careful with this one. Oh, that was perfect. Yeah. All right, before we try one out, I'm gonna add some vanilla ice cream because that just completes every dessert. All the days. Yeah, you know it. Right on top, just like that. Oh my gosh. Yeah. This dessert looks phenomenal. You know I gotta bring the sweet. You know, instead of saying the heat. <laughs> All right. That cream cheese. Mm. This is heaven, you guys. <laughs> Gotta try it. 